here na President and COO Coco Mauricio, Auto COO Paolo Libertad, and my cab Head of Operations, Chris Montebon. Gentlemen, thank you and welcome to the show and welcome to the TNC. Good morning. Thank you for having, <laughs> for having us. Thank you for having us. Okay, let, let's let's go do um let's do one by one. I, let, let me start with here now because here now is the one accredited so far. Am I correct? What is here now, Coco? Tell us more about it. Uh, here now is a, basically a ride uh, hailing application. For right now, we're uh, focused on taxis for now. So it's a like we'd like to say we're uh, the better way to book a cab. Um, so by connecting passengers um, with drivers for collaboration with the uh, government. And and the LGUs, and by uniting the operators. So that's so what we do. Is that a local company? Yes, it's 100% Filipino. And how was this conceptualized? Can uh, you tell us more about it? Well, basically, there's, there's just a need that we saw a need as early as uh, two years ago, where I think it's about time where the taxi industry needed to protect itself and grow uh -huh. at the same time. So with the advent of the private unmarked ride healing apps out there, or the TNVSs, so the taxis were really getting uh, decimated, let's okay. put it that way. So we just said, hey, look, one one thing we can do is, is try to help them out, right? And not just taxis. I mean, initially we'll go into taxis, but then we'll we'll try to get into other modes of public transportation as well. Mm -hmm. So we're not discounting the possibility of getting into tricycles, buses, uh, and jeepneys. So you're so looking at public utility Elevating the public goes. transportation system. Why that? For Why? I, I mean, I, I understand that you said that, you know, the taxi industry was having problems because right. of the um, entry of, let's say, Grab and, and Uber that right. time. So you, you focused on this, the public utility. Vehicles. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. All right. So I think this is one thing that we could maybe help out the Filipinos, right? Being mm -hmm. a Filipino-owned company, it's like how do you uplift the lives of the community, the commuting public, uh -huh. uh, with the existing networks that are already there, available. I mean, private ride healing caps, whether whatever data they show is actually increasing the congestion in the streets, right? So if you remember last year, July, for one week when Uber was suspended, mm -hmm. um, when Waze did a study from Monumento to Makati, traffic reduced by 20%. Yeah. And then our sales for cars for Southeast Asia for the past four years have grown 20 to 22% year on year. All right. And uh, so that's really adding uh, congestion, not just, and, and pollution for okay, us. Okay, so that's here now. That's been, uh, you, you got your accreditation yes. already. There are two others right now.